Gemini co-founder Tyler Winklevoss slams Elizabeth Warren's latest email campaign. Crypto regulations, Elizabeth Warren Winklevoss twins Tyler. Winklevoss takes aim at Elizabeth Warren's email campaign, criticizing her anti-crypto stance as she faces pro-crypto attorney John Deaton in her RE election bid. Last updated, September 11th, 2024 at 2313. GMT3 author, Julia Smith author, Julia Smith about author. Julia is an experienced editor with a passion for covering a wide variety of beats. She loves all things politics and regularly covers regulatory updates on emerging technology here for crypto news. Author profile, or share copied last. Updated September 11th, 2024 at 2313 GMT. Three, why trust crypto and with over a decade of crypto coverage, Crypto News delivers authoritative insights you can rely on. Our veteran team of journalists and analysts combines in-depth market knowledge with hands-on testing of blockchain technologies. We maintain strict editorial standards, ensuring factual accuracy and impartial reporting on both established cryptocurrencies and emerging projects. Our long-standing presence in the industry and commitment to quality journalism make Crypto News a trusted source in the dynamic world of digital assets. Read more about Crypto News. Gemini co-founder Tyler Winklevoss took to X on September 10th to criticize Senator Elizabeth Warren D. Ma for calling her latest email campaign dishonest as she faces off against pro-crypto attorney John Deaton in her re-election bid. Tyler Winklevoss slams Elizabeth Warren for email campaign. Winklevoss's post came in response to an email sent by Warren's campaign, which claimed that conservative crypto-funded groups were launching multi-million dollar ad campaigns against her. Winklevoss labeled her statements as misleading, arguing that Warren's anti-crypto stance has been damaging to the 50 million Americans who own digital assets. He encouraged voters to support her opponent, John Deaton, to counter what he described as Warren's unlawful war on the crypto industry. In his ex post, Winklevoss shared a screenshot of the email in which Warren alleged that the Winklevoss brothers, along with other crypto investors, were upset about her call for fair regulations aimed at protecting working people. Tyler and his twin brother Cameron have been vocal in their political involvement, particularly with right-leaning causes. In June of this year, they each donated $1 million to Republican U.S. presidential nominee Donald Trump. Earlier this year, the billionaire brothers gave nearly $5 million to the crypto super PAC fair shake which focuses on supporting pro-crypto politicians in the lead-up to the 2024 elections. It Elizabeth Warren faces off against pro-crypto John Deaton. Warren's latest email campaign seeks to rally support as she approaches the final weeks of her RE election campaign. Her opponent, John Deaton, has long been a supporter of the blockchain sector, gaining financial backing from some of the biggest names in crypto including Ripple executives Brad Garlinghouse and Chris Larson, as well as former White House, our communications director, Anthony Scaramucci. Warren has been a strong proponent of stricter regulations in the crypto sector. Her Digital Asset Anti-Money Laundering Act, DAMLA, has received bipartisan support and would tighten oversight of digital assets earlier this year. Warren made headlines when she argued that cryptocurrencies were aiding criminal organizations. Crypto is helping rogue. Our states, Warren said, it's helping terrorists. It's helping criminal organizations fund their operations on a scale we have never seen before. Despite Deaton's support from key crypto figures, Warren remains a formidable opponent in Massachusetts, where she has built a strong base. Deaton faces an uphill battle as he tries to unseat the longstanding senator. Follow us on Google News.